and Morty, episode one and two of season five is now out and available to be watched. I have watched both of them, and you guys all know I love Rick and Morty. Absolutely love it. I think it's one of the best animated comedy series that we've had for a long time. I think it's just so good at the way that they do jokes and everything about it. It's just refreshing. It's awesome. And they, they're they edgy, which is what I like as well. So we're going to talk about the first two episodes. So let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of the first two episodes of Rick and Morty. Smash it down below. Smash that like button here, subscribe, and let's jump into this review of Rick and Morty episode one and two from season five. <laughs> Okay, so let's start with episode one. Look, I loved the first four ep four seasons. Absolutely loved it. So good. It had everything I wanted in it. It was just so cool. I love Rick and Morty. I love the jokes. I love everything. Now when we move into the first episode of season five, they brought in some new concepts and some new jokes and some pretty wacky things in the first episode. I can tell you that now. The first episode is really... How do I say this? It's very different and very strange and also I don't know if it's just me or if this was the case but I swear that they used to bleep all the swear words I'm pretty sure whenever Rick or Morty or someone like that swore they were always bleeped out when I watched the first episode it's just there BAM in your face I don't know whether that's was the case when it was first airing or anything, but I know, I'm pretty sure they did. But this one, they don't bleep anything. And it's all about Mr. Nimbus, who is like an Aquaman sort of role, like King of Atlantis, like a fish, half fish, half, half human, with some unique um, things about him. And it's pretty weird. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty weird to begin with. I think the stuff with, with uh, Mr. Nimbus and Rick is probably the weakest part of this episode for me. I wasn't particularly too interested in it, although it had its funny moments. It's sort of like, it's very, very weird and it goes down a route that I didn't think they would actually take. No pun intended if you've seen it. I didn't actually mean a pun there down the route if you know, you, you'll know what I mean if you've seen this episode, but that stuff was all kind of like, I wasn't too interested. However, the Morty stuff with the uh, wine, it's gold. I That was just absolutely incredible. I loved every moment of it. The way that they they do the whole time loop and time and stuff like that. It worked really, really well. It was funny as... I mean, I always love it when Morty does like the... You know what? Fuck this. I'm doing this. I'm going to kill these bitches. I love it when he does that stuff. It's so cool. And I like how they portrayed that civilization on the other side of the magic door. And how... Like, it was just a really cool concept. And I enjoyed that stuff so much more than the whole Mr. Nimbus and Rick stuff. But overall, as a first episode, it was a good, decent episode. There's some mixed things in there. I mean, I like Jerry and Beth and how they're trying to f work on their relationship and, you know, they've got the sex positive stuff and all that stuff. It's pr it's pretty cool. It's funny. It's awesome. And there's some great jokes in here as well. And I enjoyed the first episode. Not gonna lie, it's a decent episode. It's not one of my favorites, but it is a good first start and they hopefully will get better and better and better. I still think last season's opener was better, but I still enjoyed it. Now, when we get to episode two... This one is an absolute mind, mind fuckery. It's, I get the concept of it, but again, I just don't think this one was as good as other episodes have been. I think this one was, this one's definitely one of the weaker ones in the Rick and Morty franchise. Like, I get the concept. It's a, it's a cool concept and it's a funny concept, but I think... It overplays itself in this quite a lot. There's, it's just really repetitive. And it's all about, you know, Rick creates clones, basically. And they're all trying to figure out, like, there's multiple. And they keep, the clones make more clones and so on and so on. And it's just a repetitive theme about them, like, dying and then going, Oh, well, there goes another clone family. Now we're going to move. It's just so repetitive, constantly and constantly and constantly. 
while there is some funny moments in that in here, it's definitely the weaker episode of the two, and definitely one of the weaker ones in the franchise and in the whole TV show. So I don't know what they were really trying to go with this episode. It just it just doesn't work for me, unfortunately. I just didn't enjoy this one so much. I, I gotta say, the different designs for the different clones and stuff like that is funny and it is unique and it has some cool moments of like character designs. Like there's ones that look like Pinocchio, ones that look like they are Sesame Street ones. There's ones that are like, <laughs> like all different like shapes and sizes and stuff like that. Like it, that's really cool. It's a, it's really unique how they do certain things like that. But overall, it just didn't hit the mark for me, unfortunately. And I just, I didn't fall in love with episode two, where in episode one, I actually enjoyed it a lot more. So I don't know why they did episode two like that. It's just so repetitive. I think the joke was played out too much in that so in that um, one. And yeah, unfortunately for me, episode two just didn't land like the first episode. So let me know in the comments below, what do you guys think of the first two episodes of Rick and Morty? Smash it down below, smash that like button, hit subscribe as well, and let's get to a thousand. We're at 500 now, let's get another 500 before the end of the year and hit a thousand. So make sure you click that subscribe button and that like button because it helps me out so much. And yeah, make sure you let me know your comments. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.